How are you tonight? Thank you so much. Okay, there we go. I think the settings are right. No, nope, they're still not right. Well, while everybody's coming in, I will say hello, and I'm going to switch the camera roll. And hey, look, everybody's everything's the right way now. Okay. So, hi. Okay, so I said I was going to pop in live because I it's like the early beginning of the month, and it's weekend, and I actually don't have Bunsen and Jenna this weekend, which is not normal. Normally, I have them uh, this weekend, and they're going to the Monster Truck Rally with their dad. So we switched some weekends around, and we're making some changes with that, so adjusting the schedules accordingly. And I'll let you guys know if anything changes, but what you do need to know right now to mark your calendars is that the second Thursday of the month, we will be live, and we will be talking about social media impact and how to really grow a true, deeper connection that you're leading with relationships and what matters and not leading with just a product, idea, or service that can tend to put people's walls up. And what we're going to be doing then on Friday after our live call, our live event, we're going to be within the membership of Life Above Rubies. We're going to be talking about a true um, Instagram social media impact. And I'm going to sneeze. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> uh, we're going to be talking about social media and Instagram impact and how you can really gain traction and connect and really learn how to use Instagram. Um, Instagram has made many changes in 2016 going into 2017. They've changed the way their algorithms work. It went from what's popular to explore pages, uh, the way that hashtags or are searched and found, how the algorithm, algorithms work in finding your ideal clients. And I'm going to break all of that stuff down for you guys. So even if you aren't growing an online business or an online presence, I'll show you the tips and tricks to really have an amazing, great time on Instagram. The thing with Instagram that I am really learning is that it's not about the number of followers that you have per se. It's about the number of engaged followers that you have. So you really want to have a target audience. And what does that actually look like? What does engagement mean? Well, for me, I started a brand new Instagram account in the middle of November. So November, December, January, February, March. Um, it has over 500 over 500 followers on it. But of those 500 followers, I had 300 people actually take action and come either join my group or my list. And to me, that's the real engagement. It's not about the number of little heart likes you get. It's not about um, the comments or anything like that. Those are all really important because they expand your reach. They expand your exposure. I'm going to talk to you a little bit about growing that and organically engaging in that uh, this month. And I'm really excited about it. I have now started a total of five different niche accounts in Instagram, and they're all growing at a very rapid yet steady pace. And um, my Buy Megan Elizabeth one is just still kind of there. Uh, it's been there for a long time. I've never really gone back and cleaned it up and done all the tricks with it. I did some of the original tricks with it, um, but really learning, like, what is this all about? How does it really work? And bringing it to you guys so that you really have the technical skills to succeed in your online businesses, in the online space. So I'm really excited about that. If you guys are talking to me, um, if you guys, anybody that is here, if you could just give me a little shout out that I can see if I can see the comments, because I'm having issues not seeing comments. Okay, see, I, as soon as I logged in, look at that. Okay, you have to tell me how to do that. Switch everything around. So I did a little, hey, Denise, hey, Amanda, I'm going to see. I'm sorry. So I have to, like, lot, it's so annoying that I have to look at my computer because none of your comments are coming up. And I don't think that I hid them. Nope. Did I hide them? Like, left to reveal comments and action. Er I'm swiping. <laughs> Swiper, no swiping. I can see people joining. I just can't see anybody saying hello or, like, any comments. So I'm going to just keep checking my computer screen, which is kind of annoying, but um, I will do that. Okay, so Katina asked how I switch everything around. Um, I actually did post a photo, and I can post it again. I can, like, pin it to the top. 
it's really easy in doing your Facebook Live. You always want to have your camera turned sideways. First of all, don't have it straight up and down like your camera is normally along this way. You want to turn it this way. You want to do that in Instagram, in Facebook, in pretty much anything you're doing with social media and avoid the black box bars on the sides. It's actually really annoying. It's not as professional. So take it up a notch. Just turn your camera sideways. That's all you have to do with that. And then when you switch the camera so that you can now see like my proverbs, everything's like written the right way. To do that, instead of it being like a mirror image, it's now like the way you would actually have a conversation with somebody, right? So what you do is you click on the little, like there's a little magic wand in the corner. And you normally do it before you go live. And I thought I did, but I didn't. There's a little magic wand. After you hit the little magic wand, there's a little like cross between a like ratchet and a screwdriver or a wrench and a screwdriver. You click on that and then you can flip it. Like it's really easy. And I did a little like one, two, three um, pictograph for that as well. Um, but that's just a Facebook Live. Rambling. Hi. So how is everybody doing? How is everybody feeling going into, we passed through February, we're going into March. Are you guys taking action towards the goals that we set out in the beginning of the year? Have you guys been feeling like um, you, you know, you, you went into 2017 with a vision, with goals, with intentions. Are you falling off? Because now we're, like, like let's face it, we are three months in, you guys. Is 2017 going to be your year? Or are you going to get to the beginning of 2018 going, shoot, I, I really I really didn't do much. I made a couple of new connections. I got some sales. I grew a few new followers. But my business is still just kind of flatlined. I really didn't lose any weight. Um, I still feel really stuck in my mindset. And I just am not really sure what to do. Well, that's why I decided to get on tonight. I wanted to just give you a little boost of encouragement. I wanted to give you a little fist pump of you guys still got this. It is not too late to start, even going into March. We are going to be doing some amazing, incredible things in March. Um, in the Instagram start pack, it's going to be 10 days to completely taking over Instagram. Okay, And when I say taking over Instagram, I'm going to walk you through uh, starting the account the right way, how to create an effective bio where to do your landing and lead pages, how to do appropriate calls to action, what hashtagging is necessary, how to find your target audience, how to make the algorithms meet your target audience so that you're really getting to the heart of the people that you most want to work with, that you most want to reach, um, how to run effective contests or giveaways on Instagram, how to really uh, analyze what engagement you're getting and where it's appropriate and valuable, how to do appropriate calls to action, the percentages, and how often you should post and when. Um, we go through all of that in 10 days. So it's not so overwhelming that you're like, oh, and it's also self-paced. So you could do day one and wait a couple days to do day two. Um, or you can come along with us. We're going to, I'm going to go live to be able to answer questions and support, but there will be step-by-step -step technical how-to videos for 10 days straight starting the middle of March. And uh, if you guys have been getting any of my emails, I've already been giving little droppings of that and what that looks like and what that is. Hey, Cindy. Hey, Amanda. Hey, Denise. I'm not sure who else is all here. I'm really trying to see what's going on and why my stupid comments aren't working. <laughs> why? Why aren't they working? It, it hasn't been in the group for some reason. I think other people have said they've been having a little bit of a problem. So if I don't, like, respond to you or answer you, it's because I just legitimately didn't see it. Leave your comment anyway, and I promise you I will answer you with by typing out a reply to you within the comments. Um, I just love you guys so much. So there's been so much happening. I actually just had a conversation with a friend um, earlier today and this evening, and it's just amazing to me how God – is working and part of why I'm saying like if you guys are feeling stuck and you're just feeling like oh, am I ever going to get through this season am I ever going to like make that shift or make that change um, God is going before you as you stay faithful as you sow the seed and as you continue to do the work like sow your seeds in the morning and do not quit because you do not know which is going to prosper which way I have had prayers on my heart for months and months and months and months and months, um, some prayers for years, and I am just starting to see 
have God's faithfulness in how he's going about answering those prayers and the things that he had to teach and the things that he had to um, reveal and unfold and the things that I tried to force is like, yeah, this is God's work. This has to be God working. This has to be what it is. Were shown to me like, nope, this was still you, Megan. This was still you trying to like push your own desires or your own way versus just letting it like relax and fall off and chill and see how the hand of God was really working in all things because he promises to make all things new. He promised to promises to work all things together for our good but all of those things have a big if with them and it has a lot to do with our personal heart responses and actions we still have to be faithful we still have to be working with excellence and diligence we still have to be in prayer and one of the biggest things that have been impactful is that I've been doing listening to the bible like for 90 days now I've missed a few days so I'm not like beating myself up like if I do not do it all in 90 days I'm giving myself a little bit more time, but I'm doing like the extensive and I should, oh no. Okay. I have it taped to my wall so that I can follow. It's a, it's called B90X and it's the Bible in 90 days. And I'm listening to it instead of reading it. It's a little bit more, I can follow along and I do really like the Bible app and I've been using the new living translation because his voice doesn't put me to sleep. It's not my favorite version of the Bible. But it is a very easy listen, um, and I can get through a lot of the Bible. And it has been so encouraging to my heart and soul and spirit to hear the greatest success stories of all time, of ancient of ancient days, and how God worked all things. And he still continues to work all things today. And I believe that so much with my whole heart, what he is doing right now in my own personal life, here at Life Above Ruby's, and also Above Ruby's studio, I see I see these things coming together, but these things would not be coming together without excellence, faithfulness, and diligence. And what I've been noticing a little bit is it's easy It's easy to fall off, you guys. It's so easy to fall off, and I'm not going to call anybody out to make them down, like feel down or feel bad or to feel any which way. But it's really easy to come into the year going like, yep, I've got this. This is my year. This is going to be my year. And then all of a sudden you're going, holy, Hannah, how is it already March? And what have I done? And where am I really seeing growth and change and improvement? And if that is you, I want to talk to you. I just want to talk to you. I want to encourage your heart, your soul, your spirit. I want to pray over you and with you and for you and find where your path needs to go. Get you on the path so that you can have the accountability. Because, you guys, there's a triad to success, 100%. It is needed, okay? Not only do you need to have the belief and the desires, okay, to do something different or to have something new or to be successful or to grow, you have to have that all on your own. And those desires and beliefs were planted there for a reason. They are in you for a reason, for a greater purpose outside of yourself. So you should be using them. But sometimes to have that desire and that belief, you need to build your skills. Sometimes your skill sets need to be improved upon. And you need to be learning how to do things and do them consistently and do them well. So building your skill set and your knowledge is part of that triangle. The third part of that triangle is your accountability and your community, the people you're surrounding yourself with and the ones that are going to build you up and encourage you. That coach that comes along beside you and say, think about it this way. Think about it that way. We've got to work on your mindset. We've got to work on the way that you're viewing things and looking at things because it's so easy, you guys, to say, oh, everybody's going to think this or everybody thinks that when the reality is nobody has ever said that. Nobody has even spoken that. And if somebody did say something negative at one point in time, that doesn't mean that that's the majority of the population. There's still 700 million other people out there that don't think that and have never had contact or experience with you. And so it's really learning the skill sets to walk in the integrity of character and the spirit, to work with excellence and diligence consistently, to rebuke all else and say, I'm going to partner with heaven on this, I am going to go forth with the desires and the purpose planet in my heart for a reason, and I'm going to be faithful, and I'm going to walk uprightly and be guided along the path in truth and my belief, and it does start to unfold, and just going forward little by little, inch by inch, is going to get you so much further than trying to, like, skip the whole yard at a time. 
okay? Um, what's this say? Amen. When you feel like giving up, don't. It's a lie of Satan. God has something good for you just around the corner. Don't throw it away. Hey, Tammy, so glad you're here. So, again, I'm sorry for, like, the lag in the comments, and I have to look over at the computer to see them. I think Carol just popped on. I can see people joining, but I can't see um, comments. And I swiped. It's just, it's weird. <sighs> That's really frustrating. So I just really wanted to encourage you guys, like, let's do this month strong together. Come alongside. Um, I do have some extra openings in available call slots. I am going to start using Cal Calendly to schedule calls. So you'll get actual email reminders and things, and you'll be able to select the time slot that would work best for you, which I think will be really helpful. I have done uh, over 30 calls in the last month just with new people like coming on, wanting to get some encouragement, wanting to get some insight and just figuring out like, hey, are we a good fit? I am really, really particular in who I am working with in the one-on-one -on -one diamond coaching package. I want to be sure that the people that I'm coming alongside have similar values and beliefs and are like-minded to take action and to go forth because I don't want to waste anybody's time or their finances. I want everybody to be wise with what they are doing and how they are going forth doing it. And I want to see real impact and change in your life and in your business and to have the balance the way you want it. I am a firm believer that you do not have to hustle and hustle 160 hours a week and kill yourself to grow your business. That's not what being consistent and being diligent looks like. Being consistent and diligent means you are building your skills and you are setting aside focused time to put out the effort and the energy and the work that is required of you to then go about your personal life, to go about your family life, to go about your spiritual life. It all does come into a balance. I do not believe in the saying of hustle harder. I am much more, you have to figure out the purpose statement, work smarter, not harder. I do not take pride in being a busy person. And there are seasons and times where, yes, you are more, you are a little bit busier and you have a little bit more going on than other times. I want to teach you some time management strategies that you can say, okay, I know that for 10 hours a week, I'm going to focus my time in this area of social media for the growth. I know I can get three blog posts up in this number of hours of time. And yeah, it may vary just a little bit, but truly giving it that focused time, attention, effort aligning yourself with your beliefs, your purpose, with accountability, with your community, you're going to see rapid growth and expansion faster than you can possibly imagine just from understanding where that all comes from. It's all a process, you guys. This is a journey for everyone. There is not any one person that has it all together, all perfect, more than another. You are building relationships. You are building meaningful connections with people that are going to expand your life and bless you here on earth. And I do believe in heaven. I do believe that. Okay, so Carol just said I so needed to hear what you just said. I wish I knew when she commented that. I'm so glad. I'm so glad. I just, I want to be here as an encouragement. I want to be here as a love and support on you guys. Um, I There are so many amazing, incredible things happening in my life right now. I wish I could blurt and share all of them. Um, I had another meeting with a, it's somebody that I've met with before, but he is an executive producer of a major international, well, national, nationally syndicated daytime television show that uh, he wanted to talk to me again this week. And that was an amazing conversation. Um, and just, just that engagement, just, just that opportunity, just that like relationship that was started six, seven years ago, coming back around and going, hey, you know what, you still you still stood out. There's still something there. Um, that's not by accident, you guys. That's not by accident. This is what, this is why I have preached, preached, and I hate to use that word, but why I have spoken so firmly on relationship marketing and what relationship marketing is all about. It is not about having 800,000 followers or a million followers. Yes, that is wonderful. And I I pray to God that someday he brings that platform around, that there may be a million followers on the YouTube channel or 100,000 people in the Facebook group and thousands of people as members of Life Above Rubies. But I'm much more concerned with just the one or two 
not that it is only one or two, but the one or two that are taking it to heart and changing their lives and really doing something with it that we can be engaged and grow and be that that tribe of kindred spirits, that family for the fam familyless. Family familyless? Is that a word? I don't think it's a word. But this is why you guys like me, because I make up words. <laughs> I am realizing more and more what a complete dork I am. And, um, yeah. So I'm just really thankful. I'm really thankful for you guys here. And I just want you to know that I do pray over this group, and I pray over the members, and I pray over the coaching clients often, often, daily, literally daily. Um, and I'm seeing God take action in your lives as you guys are taking action yourselves. So I just wanted to, here we are at the beginning of the month. Let's take action together this month. Let's learn some skills and some social media and some Instagram together. You can reserve your seat now. You can just join Life Above Rubies tonight as it stands if you're not already a member. Um, there are really cool things happening. We're making some awesome changes. Um, and adjustments that have been growing over time. We actually switched out our servers um, earlier in, well, middle of February, I guess. We had a couple days where we were down. Uh, well, it wasn't a couple days. I guess it was just 24 hours. But um, we had some time that we were down overnight for some maintenance. There are all new courses that are available right now. There is a gorgeous, actually, if I show you guys, I'm going to show you guys. I don't normally do this, but I'm, let me log in. Let me log in, and I'm going to show you what is happening so that you can see some of the changes for those who haven't haven't been a part. What is going on? There's still changes coming. Um, we just constantly are trying to grow and expand and make it better for every member, and we take your feedback very seriously. We want you guys to find the information that you need, when you need it, where you need it, how you need it. So let me just go ahead and turn the camera around, and I'm going to show you what happens when you log in, where you're taken, and where you can find things. Here. So this, okay, now i got to turn the camera back around because I switched the camera. Okay, back to normal view. This is what it looks like when a Ruby member logs in. It actually is, will say Ruby dashboard. You'll get a little welcome message and a welcome video, and this is going to change. It is slightly outdated. I do realize that. But I've been much more worried and focused on making sure there's new courses and content for you guys than just a welcome video because you guys know how welcome you are. Um, so what you're going to do is you're going to see this little let's get started here. And from let's get started, you're able to choose kind of where you want to go in some of these main areas that we find are most popular for members at Life Above Rubies. So there is a weekend kickstart challenge. That kickstart challenge, there are four challenges, four videos, and four downloads. Or is it five downloads? I think it's only four. Um which is awful that I don't even know. Four challenges, and I'm going to have to see why that one's not working. And some bonus affirmations and some worksheets that you can be working on. So that's a popular thing. i got to see why that video is blank. Sometimes this happens. We're still working through some of the kinks of the new server and transfer over. So back to the home, you can go to our monthly strategy call. So all of our monthly events, are now categorized here. So you can see the two that we did for January. Once was the once upon a time, and then also the core mindset belief. And then in February, we did a branding story and feel sheet, and also the where do I start, which I was sick for, so I apologize for that. And then you'll see um, March and April and everything coming up, so you can just click right on each of those links. And as you scroll, scroll down, you'll see all the 2016 sessions, and then all of additional resources and archives that we've had from a variety of different live events as well. Okay, so that's just in that live strategy session, and you can also find it up here as well. There's some extra navigation bars up here. So you should really be able to find things. I really tried to put it very clearly in plain sight. Here is the Once Upon a Time course. So when you go into Once Upon a Time, you can instantly start taking action and get access to those four exclusive videos on your character, your character worksheet, your uh, the one, the villain, all of those are in here, okay? Um, so I just really wanted to show you guys kind of what this looks like a little bit as you go through, like personality cards, more to this life, the 30-day challenge, and then catching up with us on the blog. 
There's also additional uh, things here. There is a separate support group Facebook group just for members. Okay, so you guys are watching this in a Facebook group right now. This is the one that is only and exclusively for members of Life Above Rubies. Where um, coming this March is where we're going to be doing some more live strategy calls, exclusive content, so that you guys can really whoops get questions answered. That's not what I wanted to do. Um, and then there's also a a place to schedule your one-on-one -on -one calls right here. So then there's a couple extra um, workshops and. Uh, topic courses, you can go to the start pack on YouTube, which is you're going to see the start pack for Instagram come out this month. It'll be very similarly laid out where you'll get the introduction video, all of the different worksheets for the different days, okay, video resources, YouTube templates, you'll get different things like that. And then each day will be broken out on this page day by day where you can go through and uh, really take that course to heart. I'm excited to do uh, Instagram with you guys. So you can really see there's a lot of courses here. These are like the most popular ones. Um, you can continue by searching the site. There is a search bar. You can go by recent date in case you missed it. Everything's in here by date or browse by month if you know what month that you are looking for. Um, there is more to the personalities that we never covered in the Facebook group. It's all here for members only. So it's all about understanding yourself and others on a higher level, taking the test, getting the information that you need, and how to motivate, communicate, and work with each one. And then when you're in here, you're actually able to click on each of the personality types, and there's quite a long write-up of their strengths, their dislikes, their likes, uh, what they're good at, how to motivate, how they may show up, what they may look like, how to work with them, what they struggle with, like extensive, okay? This is just for one personality type. So each personality type has its own button that you're able to click on and learn more about and study as well. And that really does help you in building great relationship marketing um, kind of things. And then there's also another support where you can get help or the Facebook support. And then this is the blog content where you can just come and just view it, all the content, all the content of everything. Anything that we've ever posted at Life Above Rubies is here in blog format. It's not the prettiest, I do admit to that, and I'm sorry for that at this moment, but I wanted to have a place where if you came, you would understand what a blog role is and be able to access all of the content in a very easy um format to just scroll through. So you'll see the past 30 day challenges, uh, permission to succeed, um, pretty much everything that if there is anything that would be missing in our little like strategy calls or in our additional courses, uh, you would be able to find it there through either the search or other, you know, the blog, the blog role places and things like that. So I am working with somebody to make this look a little bit more pretty. Um, the way that the template works for having like thumbnails and images, it it's crazy. It looks insane. So we're just really keeping it very simple so that you can scroll through and find the content from that standpoint. And hopefully that really helps you get a better grasp on what this is going to look like, what's coming up, um, and all the past content. So, that is really what is happening inside of Life Above Rubies. Hey, Debbie. Hey, <clears throat> Melissa. Hey, Michelle. Thanks, guys, so much for popping on. Um, all right. So, yeah. Where are we at here? So that is what is inside of Life Above Rubies. And I just think that it, um, with all the changes that have been happening and we're growing and we're, we're we had to actually expand – Servers, we needed more server space because we have more members and more resources coming on. So we want to make sure that we are providing all the value and all the content that we possibly can. There is hundreds of hours of video content and personal one-on-one -on -one connection with me to help you grow your business and have life in balance the way that you really want to have it and that you were called to have it. So let's take action in March. Do not fall off. Uh, get ready for the Instagram impact and start pack that you are just going to, I believe, love. Um, I actually have, I decided 
over the last year or so that I would take some additional Instagram courses and just kind of see what others had been teaching, if there was stuff that I was missing. And I can tell you that I paid over $100 for two different courses. And they only had a handful of videos, only several minutes long, which is really great for some people. It's very quick and to the point. But they didn't really show you the ins and outs. Like, they just kind of talked about how to do, like, they just kind of talked about ideas. And they just kind of talked about, well, you could do it like this, or some people say you could do it like that. What I really got committed to doing was, like, how does this actually work? How does, what are the stats? What are the statistics on Instagram? How are people really connecting? What's causing them to convert? What made 500 people that are followers kind of be loyal followers and have almost 30% of them truly take action into joining a list, becoming part of a group, purchasing something? And where where does that drive from? So, we really dive into that, and I'm really excited to do that. Um, I'm not going to try to impress anybody with, like, a super huge, crazy number. I'm not looking for that. I don't want you looking for that. I want you looking for true connection and authenticity in who you are and your ideal client. This is all going back to the same thing. So I hope that helps. I hope it gives you a little bit of feedback and a little bit of encouragement that you can do this, that I'm here to help you, that we're going to keep pulling back the layers on the technical things. I really do desire to give you the practical and the technical skills to get started, okay? I'm going to give you the direction to start. I may not be able to do a tutorial on every single technical thing out there, but I can point you in the direction. I remember feeling so lost after my divorce and losing so much in that area alone that I had to learn how to do all of this stuff and here I already was having the successful business this over million dollar business and I didn't know what to do I didn't know how to get you know beyond a simple blog post like how do I accept the payment how do I create something new how do I how do I how do I and it can be a really scary place when you feel like I'm a solopreneur and I just want to provide something more for my kids or for myself or for the world. And I really just feel so scared and intimidated to even start. And I could spend hours upon hours researching all the ways to do it. Or I can go alongside of somebody who's already been there and done the work and has a way to do it, has a roadmap that they laid out and will give you their heart and their most honest feedback and prayers and love and support along the way. And I'm not going to claim that my way is 100% the only way or the best way. Everybody has their own road and path to follow. There is not there are people out there who make millions of dollars on YouTube and make millions of dollars on Instagram and make millions of dollars doing this and millions of dollars doing that. It's finding your thing and your path to success and doing it authentically, and doing it with your whole heart consistently and faithfully, and doing it, trying, taking the action step. All right, guys, I love you so very, very much. Enjoy the moments tonight. I may pop back on tomorrow. You never know. I feel like I just have so much I want to say right now. Um, but I may, pop, I may pop back in with you guys tomorrow. Thanks for checking out what the new Inside Life Above Rubies looks like. You guys can join that now. Reserve your spot for uh, the upcoming Instagram start pack. It'll be 10 days to an amazing Instagram. Um, everything from visual appeal, exploring, hashtags, user tags, geotags, uh, security, authenticating, linking your – so hi and bye, Kayla. Yeah, kind of hi and bye. I'm sorry. I'm glad you popped on. Um, all of those things. So we're gonna we're gonna really dig deep on Instagram, and I'm I'm just loving Instagram so much right now. Like I'm loving it so much more than Facebook, and way more than Pinterest. Like I used to really love Pinterest, and I grew that really fast and really quick, and I loved it in the beginning. And it's still a great platform, but I'm just like loving the connection that is happening in Instagram now that I feel like, okay, I really have a handle on this and I want to show everybody else how to get a handle on it. Because even if you don't have a blog or you don't have a website or you don't have a sales funnel system, you can still build a relationship and lead people on a path and establish a brand. Every social media platform is so very different. I'm not even going to pretend. They are so different. They all have different nuances, different lingo, different um, 
behaviors, different user behaviors. So just understanding what that looks like and enjoying it. All right, guys, have a great night. I'll talk to you soon, hopefully tomorrow. And uh, But for sure, mark on your calendar next Thursday night, live 930. We'll be here in this group, and we'll also be live on YouTube. Um, and then other exclusive content will be only for Life Above Rubies, Rubies and Diamonds members on the Facebook Live group that is here, as well as in the back behind the scenes of lifeaboverubies.com. Enjoy the moments, guys. Have a great night. Bye-bye.